a and b and c are integers and a squared plus b squared equal 2 to the power of c find the value of a b and c okay let's see the main equation let's analyze this 2 to the c we know that uh, let's consider the sign positive or negative we can say without loss of generality, we can say a and b are greater than or equal to zero. Because, for example, if a2 works, negative 2 also works because we have power of 2. And if we want to consider c, we know that a squared plus b squared is integer left hand side. So 2 to the c is also integer. So c also will be greater than or equal to zero because if c is negative, for example, negative 1 then 2 to the c will be 1 half. So we can conclude the things we've reached a, b, and c are greater than or equal 0. Okay, now we consider parity of a and b means even, they are even or odds. We know that a squared plus b squared equal to 2 to the c. Uh, right hand side, 2 to the c is even. Only except the case that c is 0. So if I consider as case 1, c is 0, then I can say a squared plus b squared equal to 2 to the 0, which is 1. And the cases are a equal to plus minus 1, b equal to 0, or a equal to 0, and b equal to plus minus 1. So if I want to consider a, b, c, here we can say plus minus 1, 0 and 0. The second case, 0 plus minus 1, 0. We have these two cases so far. Let's consider second case. In second case, we can say case number 2. C is at least 1. So if I rewrite main equation, a squared plus b squared is 2 to the c, c is at least one so it is even so for a and b we have two cases both of them odd or both of them even because if one of them even one of them odd then their sum will be odd but the right hand side is even now if we analyze this i can say suppose a is odd for example case two one odd odd a is 2a prime plus 1 now if i raise it to the power of 2 a is squared so let me write only case things let me erase the things we don't need so here a is 2a prime plus 1 it is odd so if you raise it to the power of 2 it will be 2a prime plus 1 squared this identity is first one is squared 2a prime squared plus 2 times first one times second one, which is again 1, 1, plus 1 squared, which is 1. So it will be 4a prime squared plus 4a prime plus 1. We can factor from 4, it will be a prime squared plus a prime plus 1, which will be a double prime. So it will be 4a double prime plus 1. Now, if I rewrite case 2, 1 here again, we said odd, odd, A is odd, B is odd. So we've concluded that A is 4A double prime plus 1, and also B is 4B double prime plus 1. And, A, sorry, A is squared, B is squared. Here, we've calculated now if we calculate a squared plus b squared is 2 to the c so if you replace a squared with 4 a double prime plus 1 plus 4 b double prime plus 1 equal to 2 to the c so we can say 4 a double prime plus 4 b double prime plus 2 equal to 2 to the c now left hand side the remainder when divided by 4 is 2 the remainder right hand side should be 2 so because we've considered c0 here and here c is at least 1 so the only possible case is c1 because after c for some greater than or equal to this part will be multiple of 4 
but the remainder here is 2. So let's check this case. Okay, so c is 1. If c is 1, we can rewrite it here. a squared, there are odd b squared 2 to the c, which is 2. So the only case, because a and b are integers, is a plus minus 1, b plus minus 1, and c is 1. It is our second answer. So if c is greater than equal 1 and a and b are odd, we can say a and b should be plus minus 1, plus minus 1, and c equal to 1. Now, let's consider case 2, 2. That a is even, and b also is even. In this case, a is 2a prime, b is 2b prime, and a squared will be 4, a prime squared, b squared is 4, b prime squared. Now, I know a squared plus b squared is 2 to the c. So if I replace 4a prime squared plus 4b prime squared equal to 2 to the c. The left hand side is multiple of 4. Right hand side is also multiple of 4. You can divide by 4. It will be a prime squared plus b prime squared equal to 2 to the c minus 2 because we divide by 4 we divide by 2 squared now if i consider c minus 2 as c prime if you see it will be a prime squared b prime squared equal to 2 to the c prime it is exactly the first equation so <clears throat> we can conclude again same things we can say okay if a prime b prime b for example odd odd even even and all these things and you can do it again and again. So if I combine case 1 and case 2, 1, our answers are plus minus 1, 0, 0, 0 plus minus 1, 0, plus minus 1, plus minus 1, and 1. And only this case has been left. So, for example, if A prime, we consider again this answer, we know A is 2A prime, B is 2B prime, and c prime is c minus 2. So we can say a is 2a prime, b is 2b prime, and c prime is c minus 2, which equivalent c equal to c prime plus 2. So we have all these answers again for a prime, b prime, c prime. So let me erase the things we don't need. So, again, if I use these answers, at first we've used for a prime, b prime, c prime, we can say, okay, for second case, you say plus minus 2, because a prime, if it is this, a will be twice that, b twice that, and c plus 2, two 0 plus minus 2 plus 2, and the next one will be plus minus 2 plus minus 2 and 1 plus 2 3 and again in next step for example you can find a double prime that a double prime is twice a prime and so on like this the next one if you do it again it will be twice this 4 0 2 plus 2 4 0 plus minus 2 times 2 4 2 plus 2 4 Next one, plus minus 4, plus minus 4, multiply to 3, plus 2, 5. And if I write in general, you can say plus minus 2 to the k, and you can check. You can say, for example, maximum power of 2 is what? You prove that they are equal, and only consider the cases that they are not equal, 0. And <clears throat> this one, 4, will be, will be 2k, 0 plus minus 2 to the k, and 2k here, and the last one is 2 plus minus 2 to the k, plus minus 2 to the k, and 2k plus 1, and k is at least 0. So all of our answer equal to this. So we've solved this problem completely. If you want to learn, let me write one homework for you. If you want to learn other ideas, feel free to send message to my WhatsApp number in the description and comments. 
And don't forget to subscribe, turn on the bell, and like the video. Let me write the next one. A squared plus B squared plus C squared is 2 to the D. You can comment an A, B, C, D, R integers. You can comment your answers below this video. And you can use my other videos to improve your problem solving. Thanks for watching this video. And if you want to learn important ideas in each topic, as I said before, Send message to my WhatsApp number in the description comments. Have a great day and bye.